that look cool. Hey guys, it's Chap Tindall. Welcome to vlog number three. I'm at the chalet. Uh, my dad and I came up here Tuesday night, and now we have to head back today, Thursday, because I'm playing tomorrow. Uh, this is going to be like my last big gig of the summer. Um, it's the Canada Day Vest Festival in Port Credit. I'm gonna, we're going on at 3.30, so it should be fun. Um, we're gonna be leaving the chalet today. We'll probably be leaving by, I'd say maybe two or three. Yeah, right now we're gonna have breakfast. We're basically just having leftovers from dinner last night, so. Wow, what a beautiful day. Let's step on outside, shall we? So let me give you a little tour of the lawn at the chalet. Now, the, here's the thing. All of these trees used to be a field, okay? They were never here, but the government gave us a bunch of trees to plant in the 70s. So we planted all these and then we realized how messy and they sort of closed in the whole property. So we plan to eventually take all these down, but we still have this little bit left right here. Um, this is, I'd say this is about six eighths of an acre. I'm not too good with uh, units of measurement in terms of property. This used to be my grandfather's garden right here. And it is overgrown in here. I don't know if we're gonna take this this little area down. We might, I like I said, I have no idea. And then here's the outside of the chalet. And that part down there, that goes down to the river. We own about a meter in of the river. And then in, uh, in the summer, which is now of course, uh, if we have a lot of people up here, We'll have a fire right here. Um, and we never used to have this little cage. This, we got this at a, at a free yard sale. So it didn't cost us anything. They were just getting rid of a bunch of stuff. And it is rusty. It, yes, it does have bird shit on it. Yes, it could use a paint job. And I'm sure it'll get one very soon. Still have some wood in there. Uh, from Well, actually, no, this isn't from last year. We uh, put this in this summer to get everything ready. And right here, I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but... It's kind of elevated right there. And uh, that used to be a sandbox for when us kids were little. Now this little guy right here, this hose, um, it runs all the way back there. And uh, it used to be uh, the hose that my grandfather used uh, to water the garden. Now he didn't have to, um, he didn't have to hold it. It was just set up all ar around the garden and it would spray out water. It was one of those hoses. Uh, now this property is about 52 acres, okay? Um, this little trail right here goes to a main part, uh, sort of a field. This is a very beautiful day out, my goodness. Shame we have to leave. Do you remember in uh, vlog number two, uh, when I said I was at my aunt and uncle's? I think they might be coming up this, we this uh, weekend, this long weekend. See, my uncle is a, a guitarist, so he his band's playing on uh, uh, he's, his band's playing tomorrow, um, as well as mine, so they might come up Saturday, I'm not too sure. Now, this part of the chalet has a slight problem. In the soffit, there is a full-out honeybee nest. It's boarded up because we had to take a part of it out, and see how much was in there and uh, this whole part I think is one big hive so there's there's probably about 200 pounds of honey in there and I'm surprised it hasn't like weighed down the house so this part of the chalet is pretty neat because uh, a hill goes all the way down to the bottom and it's just it's just staying on the hill part. I don't know if that has actually eroded a bit over the years or not there's my room there there's another guest room. In here, we're trying to clear out the area. Okay, so from about here to like all the way in there, it used to be like it is over there. Uh, we cleared it out a few years ago. And in between these two trees, we put in a hammock, uh, the same one that we have at home. You can kind of walk in here pretty far until you get to a, uh, a bushy area. There's a little trail that goes in there. I don't want to walk in there now just because I'm in my bare feet and it kind of hurts. The ground isn't quite as soft as it is on the lawn. And uh, yeah, that's the tour. All packed up. All right, Riley's room. See you in two days. 
I'm home. I meant to record a time lapse on the way home, but I forgot. I keep forgetting to film in the vlogs lately. I do apologize for that. Uh, so I'm home now. I have a massage at 5.30. It's 5.15 now. I'm going to start to head out. It's only about like a 10 minute walk from here. It's very close. Um, so here's the thing. The vlog schedule is Monday and Fridays so far. But the thing is, I film um, Sundays and Thursdays. Now, Sundays and Thursdays are usually not very exciting days for me. So I was thinking maybe I'll film tomorrow uh, what's going on, me getting ready. I think tomorrow is just going to be a, more, uh, a day with more excitement and more things going on. And also I'm playing tomorrow. So I'm going to release a vlog, this vlog, on Friday, which you're watching now. And then I'm going to release a vlog on Saturday, which will be shot on Friday. I'm going to do that. Okay, my massage is done. Walking home now. Uh, I'm going to start practicing for my gig tomorrow. But I also have to make some phone calls. One of them is uh, to Samsung tech support because I'm having a problem with my phone, my Galaxy S7 that I'm filming with right now, where the gallery app is only showing pictures that are from the SD card. Now, I have no idea why it's doing that. It happened completely out of random. It started uh, happening sometime last weekend. It's not, it's only showing pictures from the SD card. It's not showing pictures that are stored in the internal memory. And I have a lot of stuff that's on the internal memory, so it's kind of a pain. I, it's still on my phone. It didn't get deleted or anything. But the really weird thing is, is that, let's say I was to add some new photos to the internal memory. Um, I was to save uh, a video, I was to save a video or photo from Snapchat. It wouldn't go, it wouldn't show up in the gallery even though it's new. So that's, I don't, I don't understand why that's happening. So I'm gonna, I wanna call Samsung about that because it's starting to become kind of a pain. I can still put it back on to, onto my computer and it's all good, it's still there, but it's it's a real problem. I still recommend Samsung phones to anybody who's watching this. This is the only problem I've had and I'm confident that I will get it fixed. won't believe how thirsty drum okay so what I need to do now is I need to call tech support at Samsung to resolve this issue with the gallery hopefully I do resolve it uh, I don't know how long that's gonna be so I'm gonna end the vlog right now thanks for watching guys really appreciate it don't forget to subscribe give this video a thumbs up um, I actually have music coming to the channel today it is now available as you're watching this go ahead and stream it the new song is called the vacant room hope you like it um, the vlog is coming tomorrow, Saturday. Uh, hope you enjoy it. Stay tuned.